my heart Point away to Arkansas and throw me like a dart Bathe me up in lithium, God knows I need a friend In a hot spring, new dream, well, start another band Play for it What's up guys? I've been gone a couple of weeks. I thought I'd show you kind of what we've been up to uh, the last couple of weeks. So we're today in Big Bend National Park. And I gotta tell you, it's spring break weekend and it is beautiful out here. So I thought what would be cool is to kind of show you our camp setup, you know, how kind of how we're living, kind of how we're cooking and what we're how we're doing what we're doing. So normally most of you that know me know that I usually travel in a Vanagon. Uh, Volkswagen van again. It's a 1987 Westfalia camper synchro and she let me down this week and so had a buddy and uh, grabbed his trailer his off-road trailer and uh, it's turned out pretty good man I got to say that I really like it the girls are sitting here we're about to start a campfire in our lucky fab shop fire pit but this is the I guess they call it a no boo no bow no boundaries uh, trailer set up here today and we just hooked it up behind the pickup and this is what we're rolling with today so it's pretty neat setup uh, my buddy that owns this says that he uh, actually carries a four-wheeler uh, in the back of this thing uh, out out when he's going camping and that's pretty cool so this gate actually lays down to the ground which is pretty cool uh, this is inside it's kind of like a little living room right now right now it's a junk pile uh, but that turns into a bed back there and uh, makes for pretty pretty uh, good sleeping in there uh, What's cool what I love It's getting hot here in Texas actually has a Dometic uh, Air conditioning system on the top. This guy's got to have a 30 amp uh, Generator to run it, but it's pretty cool if it gets too warm out here We've got a generator we can hook it up some of the other things that I like about it You've got an awning which is where we do our cooking You've got this great little slide out here, and uh, we've got our ARB fridge set up on that. You've got a Coleman cooktop here. We've got our table. You know me. We're going to have some steaks tonight, and that one's already kind of getting ready to get on the grill. I always take our fire disc. This is pretty much all that I carry. Uh, normally, I don't even have the Coleman. Coleman's nice, though, to cook coffee on and stuff like that in the morning. But the fire disc is the best uh, for just all around general purpose cooking. So what else can I show you here? This is pretty cool. You got a quick connect on the side of the trailer. I'm told that the trailer holds about 33 gallons of water. That's a ton of water compared to my Vanagon. And this little guy here is where your hose gets set up and just kind of a little storage compartment. Pretty cool. We've got a light for nighttime. And then coming around over here, you got your hose cook, hooked up. I really like this. So this is your nozzle, spray nozzle. And uh, you can do dishes and take showers, whatever you'd like to do with it. So that's pretty cool. Uh, it's set up with a battery and uh, this battery charges when it's on the back of the, uh, back of the truck. But I hadn't really had a problem with it running down yet. Uh, it's got a Tapui tent, rooftop tent on the top of it. And uh, this is where my brother and his daughter are sleeping uh, this week, and it's turned out really good. They like to open up the top of that tent and look at the stars, and they get a nice breeze coming through there, so it's been really great. No problem with weight or anything. The uh, inside is really cool. I like it a lot. Plenty of room. We threw a mattress pad, a little three-inch uh, foam mattress pad in there. And that's helped a lot. One of the things I like about the No Boundaries trailer is uh, it's pretty rugged, pretty off-road ready. Um, it's got big tires on it. Uh, it's got like an independent suspension, you know, kind of thing going on un under there. It's got these little uh, self, well, they're not self-adjusting. You got to adjust them. But if you have it off the truck like we do right now, uh, we'll set up some supports for that later on tonight. So overall, it's pretty cool. We got the guitars. We've got our storage boxes all set up, and uh, we're just enjoying Big Bend National Park.
side, but I don't want to row in the ocean with all just three. Never trade your promise for regret. Someone's gonna hold you in your own Let's hope that humankind is 